Our next guest is a model turned certified sound bath teacher and crystal energy healer. I want to know what all that is. <laughs> about this. Now she is on a mission to teach other people the importance of living in the present. Please welcome Sunshine Shen. Hi, Sunshine. Hi, Sunshine. What a thank great so name. I love that us. name. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I'm from Florida, so is our Florida State ah, Sunshine. There you go. <laughs> there you go. That makes perfect sense. Okay, so I, okay, so people might recognize you from your time at Playboy, right? Yes. And now you've transformed that kind of notoriety into this. Yes. and kind of shifted your life focus into this. Sure. What is crystal healing so, and sound healing? What is it? Sure, um, so we all have a certain aura around us um, and what we don't realize is that this aura actually, ex um, it's a 300 degree, like 360 degree diameter um, all around us and expand about five feet out, mm -hmm. right? And so constantly we're in other people's auras and it's really, which is why vibes is everything. Mm -hmm. And we always say that um, and you know, each aura, everybody has a different color and each color reflects a different chakra. Mm -hmm. And there are certain points and certain energy that we need to work on within ourselves to kind of level out and clear out some of the bad energy that we get just from living in the city, pollution, and coming across other people's low vibrations. And to do that, um, you know, you can do Reiki, crystal healing, and my specialty is actually sound healing. Um, what we do is we use uh, the four, uh, 432 hertz uh, sound frequency to tune out all the negative low vibe energies that we might carry um, on like a daily basis. So it's, it's pretty interesting. So Sunshine, this may surprise you, but I have done some of that sound therapy with a bowl. Mm -hmm. at, at, yes. at, right? Yes. And you hear it and you vibrate and you're supposed to close your eyes and breathe. It's a kind of an interesting thing. And I find it uh, interesting that you would focus on the vibrational part of that sound sure. to kind of cleanse. And, mm -hmm. and, and I'm the biggest skeptic in the world. Sure. And I thought these people who invited me to do this crazy. were a little cuckoo. Yeah, of course. But it was nothing cuckoo at all. Really? It really, yeah. it, like, it suddenly does something to you. You're right about the Absolutely. vibrational part of our bodies, right? right, right. So we're interconnecting. And right. then suddenly I, I felt very alone, but mm -hmm. peaceful. Yes, yeah, weird, yeah, absolutely. Huh? Yeah, like, I mean, I mean, I don't mean to, to be insulting by yeah, saying weird, but weird for me. <laughs> yeah, it was very strange for me at first. Um, so I actually, uh, I was introduced to the sound, whole sound bath thing by one of my good friends uh, from college. And we went over to Brentwood and the first time I ever participated in my teacher's program, actually, I was blown away. I never done anything like it. I actually never heard of it. Um, of course, you hear like sound bowls and stuff like that, yeah. but on that magnitude of, you know, eight different and healing stations, the guns, the crystal balls. I mean, it was transforming. And after the two hours, all you have to do is lay there, right? It's super easy. So wait, and you're telling me, all I have to do is <laughs> lay down. Yes. Somebody's gonna play Absolutely. some sounds. Yeah, that's why yes. I like this so and much. And I'm gonna get <laughs> and better. You can, the best part <laughs> is you guys can fall asleep. You don't even have to meditate. Right, right. What? And, right, because it just, we're tuning out your vibrations. So as long as you're within the vibrational energy, you're all good. You can just fall asleep and, and, and your me, life will change. Tell me, yeah, that, that's the interesting part to me. So what happens after? So okay. great, we're sitting in there, sure. everybody feels great, sure. we're taking naps, everybody's living their sure. best life. Yes. Then what happens? Well, um, we have people coming back week after week. Um, that's been, I, from what my teacher said, they've been coming to her for years. Um, we have people that um, had brain tumors, cancers, and you would see the, the cancer recess, and their doctors would actually come in sometimes and they would talk to us, they would say, well, there's, this is a miracle. I can't explain it from mm -hmm. a biological you know, perspective. Medical perspective. Yeah, me wow. me exactly, it's a miracle. Wow. So We're organic and, and spiritual beings, and there's no, yes. qu no question about that. Yeah. Yes. So, so it's, it's interesting how our body would respond to things. I mean, they're always talking about how you, your body responds to a cell phone and the, you know, the charges that you're right. getting there right. and how that interferes with what we're, we're all exactly. about. Exactly, exactly. Yeah. Um, I understand too that you're, you're going to have a workshop or something coming up in the next year. What are you yeah. working on? So we're actually working on um, putting together a group of a very powerful healers. Um, you know, whether that's Ricky, Crystal, uh, most important sound healing, of course. Um, we even have, you know, some psychic medium 
museums coming in with large YouTube followings uh -huh. uh, to do different, like just fun uh, booths for everybody. Um, and we're gonna put together, you know, gift bags, all the good stuff. Oh, you how know. fun! Yeah, and yeah. you're gonna do that hopefully in LA. Yes, we are. Uh, so most likely it's gonna be at the Big Hard Ranch in Malibu. Okay. Um, so we uh, uh, performed some sound healing sessions there before, um, and the owner of Big Hard, uh, she's absolutely amazing. So she takes in animals that's been abused or rescued from like wildfires and she would uh, nurture them back to health and they're super happy so oh, I wanted to give back and uh, bring some publicity as well. well so her place. so yes. do you think the sound healing is more effective one-on-one -on -one or one to a group? You know honestly um, I think it doesn't really matter, to wow. be honest, because when you come to one of our healing sessions, we have anywhere from eight to 10 um, healing uh, stations all mm -hmm. around the room. So it, the vibrations is so powerful, whether you're there by yourself or with a room of 50 to 60 pe people, it doesn't matter, no. you know? Oh, um, wow. Yeah. Well, Sunshine, how can people go to one of your healings? Tell me how. Is there a website? So, yeah, um, so you can go on my Instagram. Mm -hmm. um, I done a ton of work with my teacher, so I refer to her all the time. Uh -huh. um, her name is um, Anna Natal. Um, she actually, uh, we do this every Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, uh, uh, more dancing in Brentwood. Okay. So, okay. Yeah, yeah. All right, well, we'll Sunshine, you thank there. you for coming. Thank You're you so, so much cute. For thank me. you for being here. Yes. I, need, I, need, I need that nap with the it. sound happening, yes. Sunshine. Well, I think me too. Wait, <laughs> quiet, I'm sleeping right now. Sorry, I'm sorry. Uh, sorry. <laughs> We'll be right back. <laughs>